Uh, let, let me just tell you a little breach about that. I know that that's not, I'm not sitting many of you I know that's not uh, the right protocol. But let me do it this way. I, I want to talk about how God are more than enough. God. God. There's more than enough. In verse 16 of the 6th chapter. Of Second Kings, um, the sixteen chapter, verse sixteen verse of that sixth chapter says, "And he answered, Fear not, for they that be with us are more than they that be with them." A God are more than enough. Let's just, just lean over to somebody and just shout, God are more than enough. <laughs> Amen. Amen. I am so delighted to see all these preachers with us today. Say amen for the clergy.
sinners are those that think. With, with, with sin, which includes all of us. Comes to Jesus. Only by circumstance. So God so orchestrates. Life that he, he already knows. He, he's dealing with, with sin affected people. Uh, so, so does he? He orders the vicissitude and challenges of life to guide us right to him. Simply put, there, 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 there's, there's a lot of things you are looking at is designed to make you look up. So, so, such as the discipline the discovered in the discourse of 2 Kings chapter 6. And, and, and you and I have just read an uh, intriguing passage Scripture and the best way uh, for me to present this passage of Scripture to you is it, 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 a sum of what's the core problem. If you visit verse 8 through 13 in that chapter 6, that is noted. You, you, you find that the king of Syria launched a war against the king of Israel. In verse number eight, the king of Syria is plotting an ambush against the king. Of Israel. All right, all right. Matter of fact, it is called a sneak attack to come against God's people. And in every time that there's a plan and a sneak attack, Elisha is delivering. Some information to, to the king of uh, Israel not to go to such and such place. I can tell y'all ain't never read That's in verse 8. Uh, uh, because in such and such place is where the king of Syria had planned. And tried to ambush him. That, that happened with repeated failures of a sneak attack and ambushes. To the point that, that the king of Syria decides to call a meet with the camp. Because it is only logical result for the failure of the sneak attacks is that it got to be a traitor in the camp. Stay with me, I'm going to preach Call a meeting and ask them, which one of you is for the king of Israel? Because what we have planned and plotted has been private and has been secretive. And the only way that it could have gotten out is that they got to be a traitor in the camp. The woman servants stands up in the meeting and says that there's not a traitor among us. But they a prophet in Israel who knows what you're talking about in 
in your bedroom. And then there's a group called Silk. Oh, that's an old crowd.
sitting in his morning had been fired. Because they had a meeting behind the door. But God showed up on your behalf. Engineer, but the worst thing about being good at 
what your gift is, is to operate out of the spirit.
may give, get you in trouble. Since it's all I'm preaching to him, let me have to do something. Preaching to get you in trouble. All right. Yes, sir. Amen. Then we're going to answer you. Preaching to get you in trouble. Yes, sir. Because a whole lot of days I want to call God back. Because I know y'all know what you're going to do today. It takes a lot to keep me safe.
you and start bragging about your blessing. Anybody yeah. happy about your revelation? Anybody can get with your testimony? See, see, winning will put you at the top. And the higher you go, the thinner the air.
that you did not plan, that, that you didn't even see coming, that strikes fear in your heart. Yeah. The enemy strikes fear because the presence is unexpected. He's also scared because his position is unprotected. He comes out at night to serve all my sin. I want to tell you something. He is, he is, I'm, I'm out of here. He's alone in the dark in the yellow. Let me let me do that again. He alone. He the God, and he is, I don't know, he's in a position of vulnerability, because he's outside, where, where the enemy is, and he's out of And when you evaluate where you are in your relationship to where the enemy is, where you stand, you are more vulnerable. Because when you have done it, you are scared. That, that's that's not the only thing that is scared of. He had an undetermined plan. He looks at the master and says, uh, What are we going to do? How are we going to handle this? And, and scared. When stuff show in your life that you had to plan for. Let, let me find some of my broke friends in here. Uh, have, have a fat when you need church. You didn't plan for that. Let something happen to the, the motor in your car. You didn't plan for that. Let something happen to your child. You didn't plan for that. Uh, I gotta get out of here. Presence is unanticipated. The plan is undetermined. Says what are we going to do? And the position is unprotected. And only thing that the man of God says, do not fear. In actually saying, even if there is a plan, even if there's something getting ready to happen next, I can't move and I can't be scared. Can I get a witness? And Elisha says, fear not, for they that be with us is more than they that are with them. I gotta find somebody in the building that can thank God that he is more than enough. Hugging and some testimonies in here and that the uh, longest you've been living, you said uh, how God, uh, and that's more than enough. Yeah. I come to tell you, he's more than a doctor. He's more than a lawyer. He's more than a supervisor. Can I get a witch? He's more friends. I got to find somebody in here and they can thank God and that he is more than enough. Can I get a witness? I wish I had some help in here. Is there anybody in here and they can thank God you've had some days in your life. If it had been for the Lord on my side. Please tell me what would I do? I gotta get somebody in the building. And when you've been in a position.
finish. He was about to give up, to give in, to give out. But you found out that he is a God that's more than enough help with him. Can I do it? Is it anybody? To try and fail yourself. Can you do it? A God that is more than He is more than enough. Can you do it? I say He was enough. I said He is. Y'all playing with it. He's a boy. And that you need a God. And that more has been in more than a more than a Can I hear you in it? I wish y'all stop playing with it. I got somebody in the building. And they can thank God. You got a good help. Thank you so much. This month, I got a general prophecy this morning. And when you go back, everything that they found ain't going to be there because you serve a good Better than you can. 
Thank <laughs> you.